The games are coming thick and fast for Manchester United at the moment and next up is Northampton in the EFL Cup, whatever you want to call it. I might stick to Coca-Cola Club because I prefer that. But it is the League Cup and it's starting on Wednesday away to Northampton. A good draw for Man United but with so many games coming thick and fast you've got to change the starting eleven, and Jose Mourinho is going to do exactly that. Here is my predicted eleven for that game. In goal, Sergio Romero. I just want to give David De Gea a rest, let him stay at Manchester. There's no point going down for this game. Let Romero play. Right back, Matteo Darmian. He looked a bit rusty against Feyenoord. Understandable, first time he's played under Mourinho. Uh, he needs games to get under his belt to get better because he is a better right back than Antonio Valencia. I mean, he is a right back rather than Valencia being a right winger. But the only way he's going to get into that team is by playing games. So this is a perfect sort of occasion for him. Centre back, I've gone for Chris Smalling. Again, I think he looked quite rusty against Watford. Looked better against Feyenoord, but he needs game time to get himself back into the mode of playing again. Alongside him, I've gone for Axel Wanzebe. Now the former under-18s captain, now plays the under-21s, looking cracking at the under-21s. He's a really good prospect, perfect sort of occasion for him. Will Mourinho play the kids? I don't know, but I'd like to see Wanzebe play there. Left back, Marcus Rojo. I want to rest Luke Shaw at any point this season where I can. That's exactly why I'm playing Rojo. Even though he was shit against Feyenoord, I'd rather rest Shaw. Now, central midfielder, I've gone for a bit of a curveball, I suppose. Timothy Fosu Mensa at defensive midfielder. This, for me, is his best natural position. He's a prodigy, he's an athlete, he's powerful, he's strong, he's good with the ball at his feet and he's excellent in the tackle. He showed that at every level he's played so far and I want to see him do that in a defensive midfield role against Northampton. I think it'll be perfect for him because it's a position we're struggling right now. Maro Anfellaini and Paul Pogba and Rooney were all defensively woeful against Watford at the weekend. Uh, both their goals, two of their goals came from cutbacks to the edge of the box where our midfielders should have been. That's the sort of thing that Fosu Mensa can bring, a bit more energy to that position. In front of him, I've gone for Ander Herrera and Paul Pogba. Yes, Paul Pogba does, could probably do with a rest, but I think he needs confidence more than he needs a rest right now. He's all out of form and he needs a goal under his belt just to say, look, that monkey's off my back. Let me get to it now. And hopefully he can get that against Northampton. And Ander Herrera, the most criminally underused midfielder at the club, he needs to start, he needs to play more often, he needs to be in our starting 11 more often. Again, Memphis, he looks all out of sorts against Feyenoord. He needs confidence in his game. The only way he's going to get that is by playing more. I want to see him start against Northampton. And Jesse Lingard, he hasn't played since the derby. Is he injured? If he's not injured, he should be playing. I'm not sure if he is, but he's in my starting eleven. And up front, Marcus Rashford. Uh, I don't think Zlatan will be used for this game. Anthony Martial looked injured. Wayne Rooney is poor at the moment. Shouldn't be in this starting eleven, and he's not. Marcus Rashford should be starting up front. That is my predicted 11. I'm probably going to be so wrong because it's very hard to predict for these sort of League Cup games. But let me know yours in the comment below. Drop a like on the video as always and subscribe to United People's TV if you're new. And we'll see you all very soon. Take it easy.